everybody, Grace here. So today I am going to be doing a What's in My Bag video. And I am super excited about this because I've been wanting to film this video for so long. And not only excited about that, I'm also excited to be collaborating with Beauty Bows. She was my first YouTube friend and this is our first collaboration together. So I'm super excited to be sharing this experience with her. And without further ado, let's get started. First thing you see when you look at my bag is it says NYC and Air Postal. I was looking for a purse for a really long time and I couldn't really find one that fit my particular style and that went with everything until I found this one. And although it has pink on the front, you can also turn it around and it has this nice tribal print on the back. And it also has these nice faux leather straps with these metal loops right here. And I just thought it was a really nice bag that went with everything because you can either broadcast the logo on the front or just use the back and it's just gray. And so I can pair it with any color I want and I think that that's really cool. And then on the inside, there's just a button snap here, and when you look inside, the first thing you see is my sunglasses. And this sunglass case has Olaf on it from Frozen, and I just got this one at Hot Topic. And then inside, you have my glasses, and these ones are from Maurice's. And I really like these ones because they have the nice floral design on the side, and they look like this when they're on. And I really like the bigger sunglasses because they cover more surface area of your face. Because when it's really sunny out and you don't really want to put on a whole lot of sunscreen or a big hat, it's nice to have sunglasses that cover a lot of your face. Because these ones go down to the top of your cheekbones and to the top of your eyebrows. So I really like these and I really like wearing them outside. They're super comfortable and if you wanted to pick some up, they're at Maurice's. They have a bunch of other colors and I think that these are great. And the next thing in my bag is my duct tape wallet that I made. This one I want to say took me about five hours to make. I know that sounds like a lot, but it was actually probably more. <laughs> I like to spend a lot of time on these because it's a nice hobby of mine and it's really relaxing to me. And even these characters here are made out of duct tape and it's just classic video game characters. I was experimenting with doing pixels and so I decided to do this one. And then on the back it just has the classic Nintendo controller. And on the inside you have Mario and Donkey Kong. So I really like this wallet. I'll probably change it soon just because I make so many duct tape wallets, but this is the one I'm currently using. And then next up we have my phone because everyone I think carries their phone in their purse or their pocket, so I have my phone. <laughs> and then after that I have a journal and some pencils because I like to have these around just in case if there's something that I'm like, oh that's a really good idea, I should write that down. So for videos and also, if someone tells me that I need to do something that I might forget, I also have this to write it down. And then I just have this denim pencil case to have in case I need pencils. <laughs> and then last but not least, I just have this giant makeup bag from Air Postal. I really like this one because it's this mesh thing and I feel like it can get wet if anything were to spill or anything like that. And I have a lot, a lot, a lot of makeup in here. I have all of my daily stuff, and then I also have some hair ties, and some compact mirrors and brushes and stuff like that. This has all my makeup that I could ever need in here, so this is great. I really like this. I recommend that you keep a makeup bag in your purse, because then if something goes wrong, like someone splashes you with water, I don't know why that would happen, but if it does, <laughs> then you have your makeup ready. So you can either reapply or remove your makeup. So this is really nice to have in my purse. And that is all. See, I'm not hiding anything else. So I hope that you guys liked this video. And I want to know what your bag essentials are. So please comment down below some of the things that you like to keep in your bag. Whether they be funny or practical. I'd love to read them. And I'll reply as soon as I can. And don't forget to check out Eden's video. The link to her video is in the description box below. And... I think that's all for this video, so I'll see you next time. Bye!